Slot Toy Tutorial 1 Set Up on Shape Document. There are a number of steps we need to go through in order to set up our on shape document. The first thing we're going to do is we need a cropped image of our slot toy and we're going to need to save it to a desktop. Then we're going to create a new on shape document. We're going to check that the units are in millimeters. We're going to set the material thickness and then we're going to create the tray sketch. Now we're going to open up a document called, uh, sorry, a program called uh, Paint. And in Paint, we're going to paste the picture that was taken of our flattened uh, slot toy. In my case, it's my little dinosaur here. I'm going to select just the area here. So I'm going to click on Select. And I'm going to click and drag out just the area that I need for my actual slot toy, nothing else. And then I'm going to click on Crop. And now I'm going to go File save as PNG picture and I'm going to save it just to my desktop and I'm going to call it slot toy and hit save in my case it's going to replace what was there already so that's my slot toy image ready to go I can now go into on shape so I'm going to create a new document in on shape and I'm going to call it slot toy v1 for version 1 and click on OK it's now going to open up and the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to add and I'm going to import and I'm going to import that picture called slot toy from the desktop that will upload this and it'll say it's complete once that's done I can just close that notification panel down so you can see there that there's a slot toy picture there it is there going back to part studio now the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go over to this little icon here and click on the down arrow and create a variable. The variable is going to be called material thickness. Oh, before I do this, sorry, my bad. I'm going to click up here and I'm going to go workspace units. I'm going to make sure that this is in millimeters. It should be in millimeters, nothing else. I'm going to press tick. Now I'm going to create my variable and my variable is going to be called material thickness and 2.8 is a good setting to go with uh, for this one. I'm going to press tick. So there's my material thickness at 2.8. I'm now going to create a sketch. The sketch's name is going to be um, the trace image. And I'm going to press tick. The trace image is going to go on the front plane. Uh, so there it is there I double clicked I, I pressed ticked I shouldn't have pressed tick I should have clicked on that the sketch plane is going to be on the front plane uh, I'm going to look at that from the front view now and I'm going to choose from this one here insert image I'm going to insert my slot toy and I'm going to drag out a square as to where it's going to go I'm then going to use the dimension tool to set that out to be 200 millimeters which is going to make our slot toy slightly larger uh, than um, our prototype. Now I can press tick and that's ready to go. Uh, so that is all we need to do to set up our first document. Slot Toy V1 is now set up and ready to go.